Happy Saturday. Yes, it is Saturday. I just woke up. It's like 1 p.m. But today I have a lot of stuff that I want to do and I thought that I should vlog today because why not? And the time... It is 1.31 p.m. First, um, I definitely have to take my medication because I take medication for depression. Um, I take sertraline. So I'm going to go downstairs and go and take my dosage. Hey guys, so as you just saw, I just um, grabbed my medication. I take sertraline, which is like a Zoloft type of thing, and I have to take it with a half a cup of any liquid that it says that you need to. So like you can use orange juice, water, lemon lime, soda. So I chose orange juice because I think it hides the taste of the medication real well. I tried it with Sprite and it did not hide it whatsoever. So that's what I have in here and I have a half a cup or four ounces of it. Today is Saturday which means that Call Me Chris uploaded a video onto YouTube. She uploads Wednesdays and Saturdays so I tend to watch her videos. If you do not know, I absolutely love her. Alright, where are we y'all? Oh, text her. <gasps> I know she just took it out of the box. This isn't her fault, and this isn't the point of any. Her phone's like this with no case on it, and they drop it, and uh, it never breaks. I don't understand. I drop my phone every three seconds, so I have a case. I break my case. My paper break. My case is already broken. I don't know where this is going, but I just want to say, if you don't have a case on your phone, you give me anxiety. Update. So I just finished taking my medication and I watched Chris's video and then I was scrolling on TikTok and then I found this new song. It's called Drop and so I was dancing along with it like a crazy person. And I would have showed you guys but YouTube has this like copyright policy so I couldn't because you would have had her hear the music but believe me I was dancing like a crazy person so that's what I was just doing and I'm playing Spotify on the TV over here. I was playing it on my phone but then I thought let's just play it on the TV so that's what I was doing. So there are definitely things that I have planned for today to do. I wrote it in my planner. I um well I use a digital planner. I got some videos on my main channel like about digital planning so if you want to watch those I can link them in the description box below if you want to check them out that'd be awesome. But while I have you guys here I wanted to like share some things. I should maybe put my camera down that would be a great idea. So I just wanted to like talk to you guys about some stuff stuff. First of all, <clears throat> sorry, if you've seen the last vlog that went up, I do have a podcast that I co-host with one of my best friends, AJ. You would have saw him in, in the last vlog that went up, but it's called Crazy Kids and we literally have so much fun. Which I would love to hear your side of like when we dated and and how you were like how I how this plot all came to be? Yeah, I will gladly give that, but I know we have like an hour and something left. I know. <laughs> what you saw in me that maybe could have hinted that like I wasn't even saying that, hey, I don't like guys. The amount of times I saw you and Chelsea cut close to kissing lips because she kept trying to move it closer and closer and closer. And you kept trying to not get your hands wrapped around that ass. But how many times? I, I can tell subconsciously you did grab her ass, shake it a bit, and slap it at least once. When I edit it, I have so much fun and, like, I love it. Again, if AJ sees this, I want to say thank you to him for agreeing to do this because, like, literally, I couldn't ask for uh, uh, anything better, like... He's a really great friend, guys. You haven't seen him much, but I just want to say thank you to him for agreeing to do this because I don't normally do content with friends, 
Like, I feel like I have to mask that part of me, and I feel like now I don't have to, and it's a nice relief, but I've also always wanted to do something like that with a friend, and now that I get to do that, it's amazing, which I just got up the Am I the A-Hole episode that we did. Hey guys, welcome to another installment of Crazy Kids. I am your co-host, Tiffany. I'm the co-host, AJ. And by the way, we have a blooper that was before this, <laughs> just because my mic was being a bit of a prick. <laughs> that is if I keep it in. Come on, please. At least it gives them something to research afterwards. So if you want to like listen to that or any of them it's up on spotify apple podcasts google podcasts and anchor which is now called spotify for podcasters hi um so i'm here editing this vlog yes on an ipad which, which yes i do have an ipad pro now but i wanted to pop in here and say that when i filmed this I didn't have it on other platforms and so I wanted to pop on here and say that Crazy Kids is also on Amazon Music and also Audible. But when I filmed that vlog it wasn't on those platforms yet so I didn't mention it but now they are so if you have Audible, if you have Amazon Music, the show is also on there as well. Back to the scheduled programming. So go and check it out. I was literally listening to the first episode last night, which yes, it was two hours, but I got like an hour in and like I was loving it. I'm not saying that as like a biased way, but seriously, it is so fun. Just please go check it out, please. I, I know this channel only has like 30 subscribers, but please go and check it out because we have so much fun with it. I also wanted to bring up like I have a friend um, her name is Elise and she is looking for commissions to if you want her to draw something for you um, I can leave her info in the description box. She draws things. I will pop some of her drawings on the screen now. She's really good actually. She she is really good. She does have a DeviantArt so I can put her account in the description but please go and check out her work and if you want something drawn from her then go and commission her. She really would love that so please go and do that. So I just wanted to shout her out and also to say thank you to AJ for again agreeing to do this podcast with me. Literally we have so much fun doing it like I'm not even kidding. So I guess we can go upstairs and work on some stuff that I wanted to do today. So we are now back up in my room and um Let's see what I have on my planner. I have my iPad right here, which if you want to see what is on my lovely iPad, I have a video that I just uploaded about like a week or so ago, or maybe two weeks ago, um, showing what's on it on my main channel. So I will put that up in the eye, and I can also link it in the description box below so that you guys can go and check it out. I have a planner that I do have um, for sale on my Etsy shop if you want to go and check it out it is the 25th as we see from the top corner there see there's 25th that's the stuff that I have to do so I'm filming my vlog right now so that can be checked off then my mom wants me to make her a label for her candle business called cozy wicks she makes candles but we have the Etsy store up now, but we still need to get her candles up, but I'm the one who makes her labels and all that fun stuff. I need to make another one so that she can put it on her candle. I have to continue working on episode 5 of the podcast that I, the of the podcast that I have with AJ, which is called Crazy Kids, and then I have to edit the vlog from last Saturday when we recorded another episode. So I was just trying to make my mom's candle label 
Um, I'm not completely sure. I have an idea, but I'm not completely sure on what scent she needs. So I just try to contact her, but she didn't answer her phone. So I guess we're going to have to move on to something else. As you see, I color code everything. Um, and yes, I do like dark mode stuff, so I have a dark mode planner, which I did actually make this planner. I think you've seen it before. If you're like, well, how do you know what each color means? Um, I have a little... Um, key over here that's what I use these like lines for the key so we have red means YouTube then we have that looks like white but it's actually like a light purple see it's like a, a light purple and then we have this like orange color for my podcast which is let's be honest and then we have this kind of like dusty sage green for my mom's candle stuff then this purple is for my main podcast which I barely touch but that's what that is and then we have like a lighter orange peach color for the podcast I have with AJ which is crazy kids so if I have to do something so we'll go here so the things that are written in this green color are for cozy wicks as you see and then we have this light light orange color is for um the podcast I have with AJ so that I know what that means and then this is for YouTube so that's how I kind of do it in my planner so we found out what scent my mom wants it for like I I'm not naked I have a shirt on you just can't see it because I'm wearing a tank top and then my hair covers my strap so I have a shirt on so my mom wants the vanilla bean one for what we do for the candles is we have like each scent has like a color that like the label is so that it like matches through the products and stuff so i need to know what color to do them just hanging with a friend right now and that friend is uh texting me so that's what we're gonna do um i have my program up here i use affinity designer which it's a program that is similar to adobe illustrator it's like a vector based program i need to make the label and then i might wait to actually print and cut it i could use the cricut or i could use the silhouette because we have both of the machines so I might use the silhouette since that one's already over in that room over there. Let's make the label now. So as you just saw, I just finished designing the candle label for my mom. I feel like I might want to print and cut it a little bit later because I kind of want to work on either another episode of the podcast or start editing the blog from last Saturday. Now, I don't know what I want to do. Hmm. I could work on the vlog from last week because I haven't even started to edit that yet. So in case you're wondering what I used to edit, I used to use PowerDirector if you remember my vlogs from like back when this channel started or even like back in like 2018-ish. I used to use PowerDirector which it's not a bad program, it's really not, like I don't hate it but now I use Sony Vegas Pro 17. Um, I started to use Vegas um, in my shop class in high school. I took like TV radio stuff. My freshman year of high school we only did audio but then sophomore year we started to do video and that's when I really started to like edit my stuff and that's when I learned how to use Vegas so I'm actually still learning more stuff like I love learning more stuff about the programs that I use I have footage in my computer so I guess we can start doing that onto here and then just drop it in like that
Hi, it's me from the future. It's actually June right now, and I'm just getting around to getting this vlog um, together. And let me tell you, this angle, I'm loving it. Here, I can show you my shot. You know, the uh, behind-the-scenes lover that I am. Let me show you my shot. See, this is what you guys look like right now. And yes, I do. I'm actually working on an iPad r right now with... Luma Fusion, which I just finally gotten around to playing around with, but this is my setup that I have you guys on right now, and I am loving it, okay? Like, my shot, as you see up there at the top there, I'm absolutely loving it. I mean, look at this shot. I love that. I mean, you know, when I, I'm not saying, like, the lighting, but the framing and everything. I love it. Look at that. But I'm actually filming this clip right now just to put an ending to this vlog because I'm editing it. I mean, it's around 18 minutes or so, like 19 minutes already. Um, I just wanted to put an end clip to also get this up. This is a vlog that is right, at, like, I think the week after the one I did with AJ with the podcast, which was the last vlog that went up. So if you have not seen that vlog already, um, I, I think it's in the eye if there's room up there in the eye because YouTube only allows for five things to be in the eye so if there's not room then all of them should be linked in the description box below if you want to watch any of the vlogs that I definitely put in the like in like alternative title to this vlog would be Tiffany promotes things <laughs> like that would be the alternative title to this you know when I talk about stuff I just want to you know I show it because like I never did that before when I when I like started my channels and stuff so I wanted to kind of like get better and actually show the thing I'm talking about so when I like mention something I'll like pop something up on the screen plus that that makes it more interesting and plus if you want to check it out then you have a little preview and now since it's June here it was I'm pointing here because that's where my iPad is when I filmed this vlog it was only March but now it's June so I want to say happy pride month which I did film a vlog June 1st I want to get these vlog like I want to edit them in order in which they come out or that 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 they are filmed so I have a couple of them backed up when that one comes out you would have seen that I would have said like happy pride or whatever but um happy pride to my fellow LGBTQ plus folks out there but if you enjoyed this vlog give it a big old thumbs up give me your thumbs that would be appreciated okay like appreciated and if you like my content hit the big old subscribe button it is red uh you should turn it gray which means that you have subscribed to me so if you do that thank you so much like Mm -hmm. But if you want more of my content, I do have a main channel. It's called Tiffany Luann. And the last video that went up was the Goodreads tags. So if you have not watched it, go do it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, again, give it a thumbs up. That would be appreciated. And I will talk to you guys in the next one. Bye! It won't go away. I've got that feeling rushing through. My body, I know that it is here to stay. It's like you're.